Hey everyone, welcome back. Uh, I am back with another video. And I wanted to show you guys something that's very fast, something very simple, that's something that's very quick. So let's just skip this entire review altogether and let's just move on with everything. Um, today I wanted to present you guys with the Olay Professional X brush. I think that's what it's called, the Olay Professional Brush. Yes, this thing right here, guys. <laughs> so, uh, I just wanted to let you know, you know, I got this, you know, I, I could have shown it with you guys in the package and all that stuff, but you know what? I don't even need to get to that part. As soon as you get it out of the package, this is exactly what you're going to get. So, you're going to get this little, ah! And then it comes with this little head, and it's just a soft bristle head. Um, this is the machine that it actually comes with. Um, this is the back of it. So, you can see that there's two volume buttons. This one is to turn on the actual head. Um, and then this one's to change the setting from two different volumes. There's the slower speed and then there's the faster speed. So you can change it with this one right here and this one just turns on and off. Uh, the bottom right here where it says Olay Professional X, I just wanted to show you guys right here. Um, that part right here actually is detachable. So the, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to pull it out in order to put the two, uh, I think it's AA batteries in there. So let me just show you guys. So this is the brush head. And then it just snaps on, literally, it just literally snaps on to here. So you pretty much go, uh, doop. And then look, you just like turn it on this way. So it just goes, boom. And just see how it rotates. So I know like the Clarisonic Mia, I've read reviews about it. I never had one, but I heard that the actual Mia, the outside of the bristles don't move and the insides actually do. They just kind of vibrate back and forth as opposed to rotating all over. That's what I kind of like about this brush. I didn't, I mean, as much as I wanted the Clarisonic Mia, I just couldn't afford it. So I settled for the Olay Professional X. And you know what? I'm really glad that I did because it works very, very good with um, with my skin. Um, the bristles are very, very uh, soft. So they're, they're really good because they have sensitive skin. And I also get easily get redness. Um, the bottom right here, I just want to show you guys. It takes for, It's really hard to get the... Ooh. This is the batteries right here. Downside, upside. And then it just basically snaps onto the bottom. It's kind of hard to get it out in the first time, but other than that, it works really well. Um, so when you turn it on, this is the lower setting. And I don't know if you guys can hear it, but this is the faster setting. So yeah, I mean, this brush has worked very good. I've been using this since I can remember. Um, I've been using this for like about a couple of months now. And what I basically do is just wash my face with warm water just to open up my pores. And then I just basically use like a very light cleanser. I wouldn't recommend using a scrub because a scrub along with this is very abrasive. So it can actually damage your skin. So I'll just use like a gentle cleanser. My favorite gentle cleanser that I use at the moment is the St. Ives uh, Green Tea Cleanser. The Naturally Clear. And I think I've talked about this before on my previous videos. So um, it clears breakouts and it reduces redness for me. So you guys can use any cleanser that you want, but this is the one that I specifically use. It has salicylic acid, 2% um, of it, and it's oil free. So that's what I actually like about this because I produce a lot of oil in my face. Anyways, this has been working amazingly. It cleans, it's supposed to clean your pores a lot more better than actually using your own hands. And it, it really does, guys. Like, I mean, when you use your hands, it just basically gets the outer layer, but it's not really, it's not really like a, de a deep cleanser, you know what I mean? So when you're using this device, it actually goes deeper into your pores to clear out the breakouts, and to clear out the dirt, and to clear out the oils that you're actually having in your skin. So at the moment, this is two items that I would rec rec really recommend. It's the Olay Professional X System, um, and the St. Knives Naturally Green Tea Cleanser. This is what it looks like. And this also comes in a body wash format, which I haven't gotten yet, but it's just the same exact thing. Um, and I think this was about, this one was about $6.29, it says it here in the back. Um, and this one is about 20 to 30 bucks, 20 to 30 bucks. You can try Amazon, you can try anywhere that you want. Um, but I, I really, really love this system. Uh, if you guys have any questions, please leave your comments down below my videos. Like this video if you like it. Uh, and I will try to have more videos for you guys to come, alright? <laughs> Take care. And now for the demonstration. When you begin, you just want to turn on some warm water and just wash your face down. And just keep on washing it until your face gets very moist. Grab your cleanser. And then you just want to rub against your cleanser, against your hands, just to get it foamy. And then you just want to wash it all over your face and just make sure you get it all over your face and under your neck. And then once you do that, you're going to take your brush. And then you're just going to wash your brush until you can actually get the bristles very, very soft. This way it can go lightly on your face. And then you're actually going to turn your machine on, setting either one or two. And just keep cleansing all over your face and under the neck and on your forehead, anywhere where you feel there is dirt. You want to keep on going. Look at the grime. <laughs> And then you want to wash the grime off of the brush. Once you do that, you're going to wash your face once again, just to get everything off. And then once you do, you should be finished. So you just want to take a light 
uh, cloth, any cloth that you pretty much have, and then just dab it all over your face. You don't want to scrub it too hard, so you just want to keep on patting dry. And then once you pat dry, you should be all set and done to go. I recommend that you guys subscribe to my videos. If you guys like this video, please like, and I will have more videos for you guys to come.